I'm not good with notes, bottom notes, top notes, middle notes, but I know what smells good. Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Chelsea if you're new and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I will be sharing with you all my five must have fall fragrances. So if you are interested in seeing what I'm gonna be smelling like this fall, definitely make sure you keep on watching. Let's get into it. I am so excited to be doing this video because for fall, that's when I really like to bring out like my heavy hitters because for one, I don't know what it is about fall and winter, but when the weather cools down, your perfume lasts all day. Like, you, when you walk past somebody, they just smell you like it's just something summer can't do. I have some heavy hitters here that's going to have you smelling so divine, like so good. So, I ain't going to do too much talking. We're just going to get right into it. I'm going to have the notes on the screen because... I'm not a I'm not, not a perfume guru. I just like perfume. I like to smell good and you know all the things. I want to start off with Gucci Guilty. Gucci Guilty was one of my first perfumes when I really started to build my perfume collection. This is my second bottle. I had a bottle. I ran through it and when it got really really low, I stopped using it because I didn't want to completely run out. But I went ahead and bought me a new bottle because. Fall is coming. Well, fall is here now, and I wanted this for the fall. You guys, it just smells so good. Depending on how you go about smelling this, it can smell like, you know, kind of like old ladyish, but you just have to smell it again. You got to smell it again, girl. I'm telling you. It just, it's the perfect everyday fall fragrance. This isn't like a special occasion perfume for me um in the summertime and in the springtime i was wearing mark jacobs perfect it wasn't a special perfume for me but i absolutely loved the way it smelled and it was just like my everyday go-to that's how gucci guilty is for me for fall and winter it's like my everyday perfume running errands going out to eat it fits every scenario every scenario i absolutely love this perfume the bottle it's so pretty. It's like a gold mirrored bottle. Top comes off like this. I absolutely love it. it smells so good, so divine. It got is it has kind of like a freshness to it, but not too fresh. I just really like this perfume, so definitely make sure you pick it up if you like the smell. This bottle, I don't remember how much this was, but I'll have links to where you can purchase each and every perfume from if you are interested. But this smells so so good all right y'all next up we have everyone's favorite ysl libre it's only like a handful of people in the world that's not liking ysl libre but the rest of us we love it this can be worn in other seasons but i feel like if you wear this like in the spring or the summer you have to wear it at night like a nighttime date night scent this perfume is so good every time I smell this it just it gives me boss vibes like you could wear this like on your birthday you have a birthday dinner or you can wear it like in the fall because it's, it's heavy and I noticed like most of the heavy perfumes has like a color to it if you can see the perfume is actually like a tinted color and I just love this perfume it just smells so good to me I have this in three different versions they have like the toilet one which is like a lighter version if this is too strong for you they have an intense and then they also have the regular one which I have this is just the regular um Ode perfume I think that's how you say it I got this last year and I put a pretty nice dent in it i got it around um fall and winter time so i was spraying it like crazy and then once the um spring came and summer came i kind of chilled doing it but we back in action it just smells so bossy to me like so sophisticated i'm about my business i got me a briefcase i'm getting my job done and i get a lot of compliments when i wear this too so if you looking for a showstopper you know where to go. So next up, we have one that's actually from Dossier. And I actually really, really, really like this perfume. It's the Oriental Cherry. This is inspired by Tom Ford's Lost Cherry. I don't have the real Tom Ford Lost Cherry, but I have smelled the end. This one 
smells just like it to me. I absolutely love this perfume for fall, more so winter, more so winter, but fall and winter. It just smells so good to me. I'm not really a big, huge fan of Guermont scents. But something about this Lost Cherry just does it for me each and every time. It smells like a very rich, juicy, expensive cherry. Like, that's the only way I can think to explain it. It's so good, y'all. And I like to mix this perfume with the next perfume I'm going to show you all. <clears throat> Chef's Kiss. This is super duper affordable. Y'all know Dossier is very affordable. It's like a... um. An inspired fragrance line. So like I said, this is inspired by Tom Ford's Lost Cherry. It smells just like it in my opinion. It's no more than $49. You cannot beat that. And it smells so good. And I just love it. Moving on. Baccarat. I love this perfume for fall and winter. And when you mix the Lost Cherry with the Baccarat. Oh! Match made in heaven, y'all. It smells so good you just smell so rich so divine like baccarat when i first got it i was you know in love with it i wanted it because the hype i'm not gonna lie i wanted it because it was so hyped up and everybody was saying this was a must have so i'm like okay my friend actually bought this for my birthday because i love it but i love it for fall and winter this to me is not an everyday perfume if you decide to wear spring and summer maybe like a date night spring or summer but winter time for sure i feel like this will last on my skin and on my body forever in the winter i actually went to the mall not too long ago and i smelled like the intense version of this y'all it's like 500 dollars, but y'all like Take my word, I know it smells good, and this smells so good. A lot of people try to find like dupes. They say like Burberry Her, Ariana Grande Cloud is a dupe. But me, I just like the real one. If I am gonna dupe it, I actually do have a dossier one that's supposed to be inspired by it, and I absolutely love the way that smells as well. When I don't wanna spray so much of my perfume, I'll go in with, like, with my dossier first, and then I'll go in with a few squirts of this and chef's kiss it smells so good I get a lot of compliments when I wear this but I don't wear it a lot all the notes will be on the screen I'll have um, links in the description box where to get these perfumes from because I highly recommend all five of these and now we're going to talk about our last perfume y'all this is one I just got and although I feel like this perfume can be worn year round I feel like it's going to really really hit during the fall and the winter months. It is my Delina exclusive. You guys, I love this perfume. It just smells so divine. It smells so good. You wanna talk about rich? Honey, you wanna talk about expensive, scrumptious? Hmm. You haven't smelled anything till you smell this. And when I when I say long lasting, I sprayed this when I first got it on a t-shirt. I just wanted to try it out. I sprayed it. Every time I walked, I could smell the air around me. And the air smelled just like the perfume. I put that same t-shirt on like a week later. The perfume was still on the t-shirt. This is some good stuff. I don't know what's in here. But this is some good stuff. And this is a perfume that I will rebuy a million times. And it's expensive, girl. She's expensive. She is worth the money. And I did a collective haul of um like some luxury and low-end like things I had got. And this was in there. If you want to see that video, I'll have it linked down in the description box. But I was saying how this perfume is so special to me. It just smells so special to me like it makes me smile when i smell it and i want to really wear this on my birthday and i don't want to wear it like as an everyday perfume because it's not going to feel special to me anymore so i'm gonna be saving this for my birthday and i just love this my birthday is in november i don't remember if i said that but it's just gonna like mm. girl you got that dress you want to go to the club and you want to take it back the next day don't spray this on there Cause this perfume ain't going no way. You're gonna have to let that dress out for 
a couple weeks before you can take it back. If I had to restart my collection and I could only have five perfumes without a shadow of a doubt, Delina exclusive would be in there. All of these perfumes are good. Every single last one of them that I told you about today, I absolutely love. I love the way it smells. It smells so good, so rich, so divine, so scrumptious. You will get compliments all the time. All these perfumes, I get so many compliments on. What are you wearing? What are you wearing? What are you wearing? And that's just like one of my favorite compliments because I'm like, girl, let me put you on. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. It wasn't too long. I just wanted to get straight to the point, put y'all on to what I'm going to be smelling like this fall. Comment down below and let me know what is your go-to fall perfume. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Y'all know I love you. If you are new here, though, if you are new here, look down. See if your subscribe button is gray. If it is red, please turn it gray and subscribe to my channel. I love you all so much. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next one. Bye.